my god, stop. Look how horrible this medallion is. Oh my gosh. It's so lovely. Hello friends and welcome to San Pedro Cruise Terminal. Today is very exciting as we are getting on board the Discovery Princess to celebrate the premiere of the real love boat with Princess Cruises and CBS. We are medallion ready. We are about to get on board and you know as tradition holds, what I have to do, what is a must when you step on board any cruise ship is to jump on board. So let's get this party started. Let's start this premiere. Hop, we're on board, ready for action. Oh my gosh! This is moi! This is moi! Hello, 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 hello! So excited. We are on the blue carpet right now, getting ready to enjoy this event. So today's gonna be really fun. Again, medallion ready, got our passes, and we are expected to get a little sneak peek word on the street that, that we are going to enjoy an episode of The Real Love Boat. I know some of the cast members, so come along, enjoy. If you guys are new to my channel, welcome. I'm Alana Singano from Travel the World A to Z, and I can't wait to show you I love to show you exclusives all on different cruise ships and so much more so come along hit the like button and let's get started for this fun event Now there's even more to hear from the old cast and the new cast as I will have some exclusive A to Z interviews for you that you can look for. Check the link in the description box for those videos to come out shortly after this one is posted. With my friend Molly, who we actually cruised with a couple months ago now and Molly has a really great idea, don't you? Yeah, okay, so I, I really loved my time on the Discovery ship Me last too. time. So I think what I'm going to do is just give my medallion to somebody who's actually getting off, and I'm just going to stay on. Yeah. I'm going to hide in the bathroom while they disembark. Okay, that's the plan. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. Sneak and, on. And we can place. just uh, hope that our old rooms are ready. Available. Yeah. Just go to my old room, knock <laughs> on the door, and be like, sorry, there must be confusion. This is my room. Yeah. Well, and if not, we'll just sleep on the pool deck. There you go. There's Move, nice, movies. there's comfy chairs. On the pool Movies deck. under the stars, yeah. added loungers. Wait, we can go to that sanctuary at the front where oh. they have the cushy ones. Okay, we're hiding in the sanctuary, the enclave. Yeah. Go check out those vlogs if you want to see all of the ship and how we enjoyed it because it's spectacular. Oh my god, it's so beautiful. All right, let's celebrate the love boat. <laughs> Showtime in the Princess Theater. Here we go. to see the premiere of The Real Love Boat. Getting a inside sneak peek, an A to Z exclusive. I'm so excited to check this out. Thank you. Well, I'll let you know how it goes.
venture on the most exciting matchmaking journey to ever come aboard a cruise ship, the real love boat. Now, this isn't a remake, this isn't a reboot, this isn't a revival of the show we know and love. This is something exciting and new. This, <laughs> this is an original show where singles get to open their hearts and open their minds to find love as they set sail through the Mediterranean. And we are excited to share it with you. Now, by show of hands and woo-hoos, how many of you have seen the original Love Boat television show? <laughs> A couple of them. All right. All right. Well, it is a classic, and myself is how I was introduced to Clayton. Hi, I'm Ashley. Hi, I'm Ezra, and I'm the producer of the Hero Board. Hi, I'm Ezra, and I'm the bartender. We all remember the Love Boat, the original Love Boat. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I'm Ashley, and I'm the bartender. Hi, I'm Ezra, and I'm the bartender. We all remember the Love Boat, the original TV series. I love the original Love Boat. If I got a dollar for every single time I've been called Judy McCoy, my job in the real Love Boat is just to be here, there, and everywhere. I'm a bartender, I'm a therapist, and honey, I am a matchmaker. My job is to navigate from port to port. I also help on navigating love and romance. I am so excited to help these singles make the best decisions possible. I will lock somebody in a cabin together if that's what it's going to take for these people to fall in love. It's just an incredible opportunity to find love. For one, you're on a cruise ship. One of the most special parts about being on a cruise ship is being outside, being under the stars. Two, you're in the Mediterranean, one of the most romantic regions in the world. You see, if there is a couple that managed to bond our love to marry them at the end of the voyage. And we are hitting up 12 major cities. Barcelona, Messina. Naples. If you cannot fall in love in Santorini, I got nothing for you. Three, all of these singles are smoking hot. And four, you've got this dream team here of myself, Matt, and Captain Paolo, making sure that you have the most magical experience. So tune in to The Real Love Boat. It truly will be exciting and new. Come on board Wednesday, October 5th. We're expecting you on CBS. And finally, watch. Oh, waves and all framed with the romantic and picturesque uh, scenery like you know, Santorini or anywhere in the Mediterranean really. So I think uh, the whole peaceful environment, environment it makes it more conducive to uh, people that comes on board for cruise, they leave all the trouble behind as we say, because it's kind of magical when you come on the ship and you feel you are entering on this atmosphere that it's, uh, it doesn't have any problem, uh, everything is taken care of. So you are more inclined to be open up to relationships and to meet people and uh, uh, maybe develop into uh, fun love. And uh, yeah, I guess that's it. Absolutely. <laughs> and we hope our singers did. Absolutely. No strangers to ships, but this was all of our first TV show. So it was so fun because, you know, we had our hosts who are very well versed in film and TV. So for them, the ship was the exciting and new part pun absolutely intended, but for us, it was the film and TV getting to experience that, but also already feeling at home because we're so used to being on board. It was just a once in a lifetime opportunity and I can't wait for everyone to see it. <laughs> cruise director to one up. How do you use being a cruise director to help people fall in love? Yeah, do you know what? I think I did this for, for so long now and, and to be able to take those skills onto the show and watch these singles come on board and I think the youth of today are so used to you know dating through an app right on on Tinder and, and Bumble and, and Tumble and all these other things that they're, they're, they're going on today and I think people they, they forget right they forget that hey you can actually have a conversation in person so to be able to like you know push them along just a little bit and be like introduce yourself that was really cool man and yeah it was it was interesting to see <laughs> you gotta push them with your foot sometimes yeah, a bit of everything just go as a child of the 80s and uh, 70s, the original series, it was everything. You know, Rebecca and I watched the whole thing, again, well, a lot of the whole thing, I mean, there's 10 years of it, to get pumped for this show, The Real Love Boat. The scripted show, it was an original, it was an inspiration 
for the real love boat. Filming for us, and I speak on behalf of everyone who was involved in the real love boat, it was a magical experience. The ship, the regal princess, the destinations, the Mediterranean, it was, it was magical. It was the perfect setting for romance, and we are so excited to watch our couples as they embark on their search for love and looking for real connections. These are real people, folks, looking for real connections. That search was helped along by the amazing Real Love Boat crew, Captain Paolo, Cruise Director Matt, Bartender Ezra. Love them. Between all of them, they have 40 years of experience on Princess Cruises. And they are two of the original cast members of the Love Boat. Please welcome Jill Wheeler and Ted Man. Ted, you, you don't know this, but when I went on my first cruise as a guest, Every picture that I took, I had the double barrel finger point. Every single picture. Every one of them I did. You know how I got that? How, how did you get Because I'm an actor and they said, look into the camera and smile. And I said, as an actor, what am I smiling about? What is my motivation? And the producer said, think about your check. <laughs> <laughs> Watch carefully, because people don't know how to do this, you know? <laughs> Sometimes people do like this. Hey, Isaac, is this it? No, you have to drop it. So here you go. Yes, yes. Tell you something. I I had the best time ever because Ezra, who was playing the bartender on the show, she and I got have a great chemistry, and if you watch the show, you'll see it. I was only supposed to do two days of filming. Oh my. Remember this? We were only yeah. supposed to do two days, but we just clicked. And the producers came and knocked on my door after the second day and said. Say, listen, we like what's going on between you and Ezra on camera. And I'm glad they said, on camera. Yeah. <laughs> and they said, we want to film another day with you and Ezra. And I said, absolutely. And we had a great time, didn't we? Don't it you think so? It was so special, Ted. I can't stop talking about you to everyone that I know. I'm like, he is amazing. He's even better than you would think. We had so much fun, and I think it's going to show. Yeah. You get that sneak peek, all right? So. But with that being said, take a look. This is Act One, Episode One wow. of The Real Love Boat. <laughs> I have uh, buddies here who are fearless and not so fearless, huh? I'm not scared. Ah, Mr. I'm Scott, terrified. Eddie, Erica from America, I'm where are you hiding? Susie! Cruise, yes, please. Hello. This is the second thing. Oh, God, I got Strutting our stuff on the skywalk. <laughs> As you can see, what an incredible event. Then I continued with an after party after the kickoff event and watching a bit of the premiere. We got to have a fantastic time. Thank you so much for Princess for having me out and sharing this wonderful experience with the kickoff party. I really loved my time on the Discovery Princess and it was so wonderful to be back at San Pedro Cruise Terminal. Friends, check out The Real Love Boat on CBS or Paramount Plus October 5th. You won't wanna miss it and I'll be watching along with you. Thanks so much for watching. Be sure to hit the thumbs up and until next time, ciao for now.